<coughs> Welcome back to Mass Effect. The way we left off, me and Talia just met each other again and we're splitting up to finish off what's happening here. As weapons fire, they build up heat, injecting a thermal collapse weapons to cool them down. Oh, cools weapons to prevent malfunction. If you're out of clips, you can't fire. You know, that don't really make much sense. Just have an ammo-based system. Not a heated-based system, but that doesn't actually function as a heated-based system. It doesn't work. Because you'd still be able to shoot. Once your gun drop functions, then you'd have to switch to another or whatever. That would work, but no. Oh yeah, let's play. Let's stop rambling. We'll take care of him. Got another shotgun. Whoa, what did I do? What did I do? Thanks. And I'm gonna hack the safe. Wow, damn, I didn't pay attention. Wait, was that a, was that a one time one? No! That's bollocks. Screw that safe. That's just bad. It's a one time only safe. That's shite. There's overload on Target down! Use overload on it. Uh, which one of you got overload? You do. You just got too close to him. Oh, hi there! I got him! No, you didn't. and kill them. Probably not kill them, but eh, that's a thought. Well, time to jump out this window. Oh wait, you can't jump in this game for some reason. I don't think you can jump in any of the games, to be honest. <laughs> oh, hi there. Uh, you just rocketed me. Take point. Okay. You'll be there. Go to ground. Miranda, go. Oh wait, y'all can just go Take there. Take point, Shepard. We'll cover the door. Anything to loot? Nope. that mega mech baby. You're dead. Well, at least you are now. Yeah! What? Hold on, I can't cut, I can't pause the cutscene. That mech's got heavy armor plating. Those quarries never stood a chance. This is gonna be and one of the And you eat this whole damn piece. Down. Okay. Not just the back end of it. Okay. Overload will take out that shield. Oh, thank you. Why? Why would you? I got a shotgun. I don't need overload. 
know why I never used a shotgun before. Systems failed. Systems failed. Not use utilities. I don't know why I told me to use utilities. Oh, hi, Tally. This is your chance to go find Beaton while I tend to the wound detector. He's probably somewhere in the back of the loading. Oh, don't mind me. I'm just going to take your med and credits that were going to be behind you to help you. Oh, that's what that is. I was wondering what that noise was. Oh, ammo case. Uh, okay. Hey! Yeah! Okay. There we go. Once we get this stuff. One thousand credits. Alright, I'm gonna pause here. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Let's continue this. Also, we move this to over here. So we've just got a thousand credits. I see. Oh. Um, am I going up here? I think so. Yep. survivors, Vitor. We just got here. You don't know. You didn't see. But I see everything. Looks like security footage. You must have pieced it together manually. What the hell is that? My god. I think it's a collector. Is that some kind of alien? They're a species from somewhere beyond the Omega-4 relay. Only a few people have ever seen one in person. They usually were. Yeah, we were shot down by them. Ha, If they're involved with the Reapers somehow, it could explain what happened to the colonies. The collectors have advanced technology. They could have a weapon that disables an entire settlement at once. The Seekers swore. No one can hide. The Seekers find you, free you. Then the monsters take you away. What happened next? The monsters took the people off the ship, and then they left. The ship flew away, but they'll be back for me. No one escaped. I think that's probably all we're getting out of them, Commander. We finally find a witness, and he's so off his nut he can't even tell us what he saw. I studied them, the monsters, the swarms. I recorded them with my army tool. <coughs> Lots of reading. Electromagnetic, dark energy. We need to get this data to the elusive man. Grab the quarry and call the shuttle to come pick us up. What? Vitor is injured. He needs treatment, not an interrogation. We won't hurt him. We just need to see if he knows anything else. He'll be returned unharmed. Your people tried to betray us once already. If we give him to you, we'll never get the intel we need. Prada was an idiot, and he and his men paid for it. You're welcome to take me to the army for data, but please, just let me take him. He's traumatized, and he needs medical care. Callie will give us the army tool data and take him to the flotilla. Understood, Commander. Thank you, Shepard. I'm glad you're still the one giving the orders. Good luck out there. If I find anything that can help you, 
I'll let you know. We're ready for pickup. Ooh, spooky fat demons with long heads. Ooh. Ah, woo, woo, woo. Shepard, good work on Freedom's progress. Uh huh. The Corian forwarded their findings from Vidor's debriefing. No new data, but it's a surprising hollow branch given our history. You and I have different methods, but I can't argue with your results. Do you ever think about playing nice once in a while? Diplomacy is great when it works, but difficult when everyone already perceives you as a threat. But more importantly, you confirm the Collectors are behind the abductions. Why do I get the feeling you knew about them already? I had my suspicions, but I needed proof. The Collectors are enigmatic at best. They periodically travel to the terminal systems, looking to gather seemingly unimportant items or specimens, usually in exchange for their technology. When their transactions are complete, they disappear as quickly as they arrive, back beyond the unmapped Omega-4 relay. Until now, we've had no evidence of direct aggression by the Collectors. Why is the Omega-4 relay on map? What do we know about it? Only that no ship passing through it has ever returned. Our best guess is that the relay reacts differently to Collector vessels, allowing them safe passage. If they can manipulate relays, that's just further evidence of the connection with the Reapers. Any ideas on why the ship is a focus to humans? Uh, if they're agents for the Reapers, it could be any number of reasons. Obviously, humanity played a huge role in Sovereign's destruction. That might have been enough to draw their attention. What really concerns me is why they bother abducting the colonists. Once the humans are paralyzed, why not just kill them? What are the Collectors getting from these deals? The Collectors aren't very forthcoming about their motives. Generally, they seek out species with rare genetic mutations or abnormalities. They pay slavers and work groups exorbitant sums to obtain these specimens, and then they leave. But they've never targeted a single species before, and the previous sample sizes were in the dozens, not the tens of thousands. What are you? What aren't you telling me? You're holding something back. How do you know the Reapers are involved? The patterns are there, buried in the data. The Council and the Alliance want to believe the Reaper threat died with Sovereign. You and I know better. I won't wait until the Reapers are on the march. We need to take the fight to them. Agreed. I hate waiting, but I'll need a team. A good one. I've already compiled a list of soldiers, scientists, and mercenaries. You'll get dossiers on the best of them. Finding them and convincing them to work with you could be challenging, but you're an extra leader. I'll continue to track the collectors. When they make their next appearance, I'll notify you and your team. Be ready. Keep your list. I want people I trust. The ones who help me stop Sarah and the guests. That was two years ago, Commander. Most of them have moved on, or their allegiances have changed. Where's Ashley Williams? She's still with the Alliance. Promoted. Her file is surprisingly well classified. What about Tally? She already helped us on Freedom's Progress. That was unexpected. I need more info before I'll find out. Where's Garrus Vakari? Vakarian disappeared a few months after you were declared dead. Even we haven't been able to locate her. Where's Liara Sassoni? She's on Ilium. My sources say that she's working for the Shadow Broker. If so, she can't be trusted. Okay, I get it. They're unavailable. You're a leader, Shepard. You'll get who you need. I'm still a specter. Maybe I can get the council to help us out. If you think you can convince them, by all means. Just remember, you've been gone a long time. Things have changed. Keep your list. Oh, oh I clicked the wrong thing. The ones who helped me stop Sarah at the get. That was two years ago, Commander. Most of them have moved on, or their allegiances have changed. Okay, I get it. They're unavailable. You're a leader, Shepard. You'll get who you need. You worry about the collectors. I'll make sure my team's ready. Good. Two things before we go. First, head to Omega and find Morton Thorpe. He's a brilliant celebrity. Our intelligence suggests he may know how to counteract the Collector's paralyzing secret swarms. I haven't even started and you're telling me what to do? I'm giving you direction. What you do with it is up to you. I'm sure you can help out. All right. What's the other thing? I found a pilot I think you might like. I hear he's one of the best. Someone you can trust.
How was he walking? I thought he was too frail to walk. Hey, Commander. Just like old times, huh? I can't believe it's you, Joker. Look who's talking. I saw you get spaced. Got lucky with a lot of strange attacks. How'd you get here? It all fell apart without you, Commander. Everything you stirred up, the Council just wanted it gone. The team was broken up, records sealed, and I was grounded. The Alliance took away the one thing that mattered to me. Hell yeah, I joined Severus. You really trust the elusive man? Well, I don't trust anyone who makes more than I do. But they aren't all bad. <laughs> Save your life. Let me try. <laughs> Normandy SR2. I love the cinematic view. It's a dramatic moment, especially for people who played the first game and missed it when it was blown up. In the second. Here.